Thank you for pointing that out. Dr. Pelkey, um, you, in your testimony today, mentioned that extreme weather events are not necessarily caused by climate change. In fact, the IPCC has said there's low confidence that there's any connection between climate change and extreme weather events. Um, why are some climate scientists claiming that there's a connection when uh, you and other scientists in the IPCC all says there's likely not a connection? Yeah, when, when you talk about trends and extreme events, it's really important to focus on the phenomena. You're talking about hurricanes, floods, drought, and look at those individually. Um, it's long been a puzzle to me why there would be any controversy over this topic, since something like a hurricane is pretty big. It's easy to see when it occurs. We have very good data on it. Um, in the United States, the a number of hurricanes and the intensity of hurricanes is down by 20 percent since 1900. Um, I don't put a lot of stock into that because you can start at different dates and get different trends. But the point is there's no evidence to suggest that hurricanes, either in the U.S. or globally, are increasing. Uh, and the same goes for floods, drought, and tornado. Um, and don't believe me, you can look at the appendix uh, that I provided with data from the IPCC. Um, so why people would hang their hat on long-term trends in extreme weather um, is a puzzle. Okay. Thank you, Dr. Pelkey.